This is Akshay Kumar from uh, Department of Chemistry at IIT Guwahati. Uh, uh, we are chemists practicing organometallic chemistry and catalysis. And when we do catalysis, we bring about transformations that are of industrial relevance. And industrial relevance is currently towards mostly towards energy and uh, self, -sustain self sustainability. Towards this direction, we are looking at the transformation of uh, biomass or any waste to use, um, anything useful. This might, these useful things may be specialty chemicals, value added chemicals or hydrogen regardless of the color, green or other waste. So we are focusing at the most favorite reaction to generate hydrogen that is the reforming of methanol. Typical catalysts that bring about the reforming of methanol behave like Brahmastra. In that, they are not selective. They lead all the way up to hydrogen. Apart from it, they destruct the molecule towards carbon dioxide. Furthermore, the reaction is uh, highly energy uh, intensive. The reaction occurs at temperatures as high as 300 degrees Celsius and at pressures as high as 20 atmospheres. So uh, when we began our studies, we wanted to address these things. The question is, can we lower the temperature? The other question is, can we bring about this reaction in a selective fashion? Can we stop the reaction in between so that we get value addition of methanol? With this in mind, we looked at the, uh, homogeneous catalysts and the homogeneous catalysts that we selected were based on pincers. Typical Molecular catalysts involve uh, um, a metal center held by organic groups with one point of contact. But then the holding the metal with one point of contact is very difficult, it is less stable. On the other hand, if you hold the metal with two points of contact, it imparts greater stability. Much more stability will be imparted if there are three points of contact, like the central, uh, central point of contact is the mouth of the crab and the two flanking groups are the claws of the crab. Further point of contact would be um, much stable but then it comes at the cost of the reactivity. So three points of contact is optimal and the, there are other three points of contact available around the metal center wherein incoming groups here for example uh, molecules from biomass they can interact amongst themselves on the metal center, they can do the chemistry and they can leave the metal center. So this is a platform where chemical marriages happen and um, typically homogeneous catalysts do not have any support on the back side, they go into solution. So these, these catalysts are now suspended on inert supports so that this catalytic system will have the selectivity of a homogeneous system and because of the anchoring groups, they have recyclability. They can be used cycles after cycle without losing the catalyst into the solution and it results in better recycling. This is how a pincer looks like on a molecular level. So in a pincer, the organic moiety holds the metal center much like a crab holds its prey in its mouth with both of its claws on the side. So the pincer is made of organic ligand which is synthesized through a multi-step process and which are further purified through a column chromatographic technique. This organic ligand on reaction with a metal salt produces a very bright and colorful pincer metal complex which on reaction with tons of methanol and water uh, produces a large amount of hydrogen and formic acid which is a very valuable industrial chemical. The main aim of this project is to selectively produce hydrogen as a clean burning fuel and formic acid selectively.